Good morning, everybody. Mystic Modeler from the garage on a beautiful uh, Thursday morning. Um, just want to give a quick update on uh, my next build I'll be starting in the next couple days. It's a kit that I've talked about that I've had for a while. It's the uh, Bark Steamer. I'm going to do a ship. My favorite, one of my favorite builds. And uh, it's pretty cool. I got a lot to do. It's the first one I'm going to make my own rack lines with. So um, I have a jig with it, so that'll be fun. It's um, 1 to 100 scale. It's the steam bark. It's a French ship. It'll be pretty cool. I just got the hull. As you can see, it's pretty good size. Gonna be a lot of fun, a lot of detail on it. Got some cleaning up to do here, and we'll get the hull and the deck and everything else uh, going over the next couple days. The instructions are fun because they bounce around and they have different numbers. At least I got some Tamiya paint numbers, but I'll follow my own scheme. You know the. Uh, Instructions are fairly easy. The English side is here on the pictures, and the building of it is on. Oops, I'm sorry, this side. So this picture doesn't match what's going on on this page. Over here on the side, it matches what's going on this page. So I'm going to make a copy of this and just put it up on front of here so I have it and I've been reading over the instructions so I'm ready to go with this thing and that's what I'm going to do today is highlight some things and write some things and make some copies. Um, this will look nice on my shelf that we uh, moved in the, out of the dining room over to the side. Uh, it'll look really nice but it's a good size hole, 1 100 scale. It's going to be red with a black bootstripe and um, white, flat white, and then a lot of detail onto it. So, um, you've got to clean it up a little bit, a little bit of flash. Not bad. I've never made one of these kits before. Unfortunately, uh, I don't know. It is a Russian kit, a ZBEZDA Zevda, and uh, I got this a long time ago. So I, I don't think I would have bought it uh, for what's going on now, but I do have it in my stash and I do like the ship and it is a French ship, so I'm not uh, supporting anything. I'm not on a political platform on this channel anyway. It's a model building channel. Uh, I do support the Ukraine though and um, we need to give as much help as we can and that's about as far as I'm going with my political views on YouTube. So um, I'm looking forward to the build. My big rig came out really nice so I got that done and uh, I'm moving on to this. I'm really going to take my time with this and try to really uh, get this down pat and uh, we'll see what happens. So that's what's going on. Thank you for all for the great comments that you all left on my final reveal of the uh, Peterbilt 359 conventional tractor for um, Jim's model garage uh, group build. And uh, I really appreciate all the kind words. And um, I watch all you guys all the time. I'm waiting tomorrow. My uh, 1912, I believe it is, Model T conventional by IMC is coming in. Um, and I, I looked that up and I forgot IMC is out of Kiev, uh, the Ukraine. Uh, that's what it said on the instructions. So um, um, I hope all of that is doing okay. And um, that's about it. So I'm going to enjoy the morning reading the plans, trying to figure things out, see what I want to do. Maybe get the hull together in the deck put together so I can uh, 
start painting it the way I want to. Step one here, as you can see, pretty easy. And um, I want to say, Frankie, I just saw your your video on um, the trumpeter dreadnought. I like that ship. I was going to get that. I think that's in my. Uh, I like the dreadnought ships because I used. I like the USS Olympic. I did, and. Um, I like the British dreadnoughts, the German dreadnoughts of that time period. So, um, 350 scale with photo etch, on, that's on my radar for the future to get something. But, like I said, I'm waiting on that Model A. I think it's Model A or Model T, 1912 commercial vehicle. Paint it up. See what I can do with it. So, until then, you guys hang in there. Have a great day. Thank you again for all your comments, and um, I really enjoy, oh, I lost my cursor here, to see if I can find it. Oh, I found it. There we go. I really enjoy your comments, and I appreciate it, and uh, what a great modeling community. And uh, Max, we'll see you tonight, 5 o'clock, at the uh, Hooligans. We'll eat outside. It's going to be a beautiful evening. So, um, hang in there, be safe, take care of everybody in your family, peace out, hang in there guys, bye now.